Hello submarine friends. Well we made it back from Cooney Lake. We left at 5.30 this morning. We drove out, we picked up a friend of mine, Andrew, and we headed out to the lake. We launched the sub, towed it out. We towed it out to a point where we actually sank the sub 450 feet plus change. Now, to be fair, the rope is on a bit of an angle that goes from the sub to the surface because the wind was blowing pretty good and it pushed the buoy it pushed the buoy up the lake just a bit. So I'm gonna call it 425 feet to be safe. I'm pretty happy with that. So after one hour of soak time on the bottom of the lake, we returned. We pulled on the buoy line, which releases air into these two valves, this tank and the opposite tank, and it came up no problem. So it came up to a level about here because these tanks only bring it up to this level. We then towed it back to the dock and inflated the other tanks, which brought it up to full height. It's super easy to load on the trailer. I can't tell you, it's fantastic. I do have to add some stoppers on the deck of the trailer so I could just pull the sub on and it automatically stops exactly where I want it. And then you just tow it out and tie it down, and you're done. So now I'm going to paint the sub properly put all the stuff in it that it needs and get her all working, paint the trailer, make it all nice, uh, carb kit in one of the carburetors on the outboard and we're going to be in business with a nice portable submarine operation. I have to say I'm very pleased with it. It's turning out to be a great summer project. It should be finished by the end of the summer no problem and we'll have something to play with. So until the next video, ciao!